Vice Chancellor of the Global Wealth University, Togo, and prominent philanthropist, Professor Chris Imumo Len, has urged the young people to get their permanent voter cards, as that is the way to be involved in deciding who handles the machinery of government in 2023. Professor Umumlen gave this charge while declaring his intention to run for the presidency of Nigeria during the JPTS convocation ceremony in Ogun State. Justin Akadonye has more. Believe me, from next year, Nigeria will begin to change its shape and narrative globally. The race to who governs the machinery of government is gathering momentum. Joining the list of those who have indicated interest to run for presidency is Professor Chris Imomolen, the university vice chancellor who made his intention known before this mammoth crowd, says the issues of insecurity, youth unemployment, and bad economy, among others, can only be traced to bad governance. Hence, his decision to run. My major reason for wanting to do this is to see how, as a young person, I've succeeded privately. I believe and I know that if given the opportunity, we can also change the narrative for Nigeria and make Nigeria great because the country belongs to all of us and we all need to come together and see how we can contribute our very best to rescue Nigeria from the insecurity problem, the unemployment challenges, the poverty challenges and a whole lot. We, we don't even have good news anymore. Professor Imamolin says he is not unaware of the party politics in Nigeria, which oftentimes direct the flow of governance. Although he has not decided on which platform to pursue his ambition, he speaks of mobilizing 40 million Nigerian youths to actualize this vision. But I want Nigerians to begin to look beyond party to personality. You know, a party can just drop any, any, anybody to become leaders and because of politics. But we need to begin to see when, as a time like this, where we need a technocrat. I have built platforms that have empowered millions of Nigeria. I have the largest institute in Africa. I'm the only African who have set up three universities globally. I have done it. I'm the only African who have his name on the World Book of Greatness. I've achieved so much. Look at past leaders. I don't want to start throwing stones, but by the time you compare what I've done privately with what other leaders have done when they were not in politics, I think you will be able to to, to know. See, success has a, has, a, has, a, has, a, has a trajectory. And once a man is successful, who has a good heart for his people, I think that can be repeated to help the nation become successful. He urged the citizenry to vote a leadership that will change the country for good so that all will be proud to call themselves Nigerians. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.